What's up you guys, it's Hannah. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be the first back to school video of the year. They ask you how you are and you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. This is going to be my What to My College Backpack slash School Supplies Haul for 2019. Last year's installment of this video was actually my most popular video on my channel. But I am so excited to film this because you guys know I love office supplies and I get really excited to show you guys all of my stuff for the new year. I got some really cute stuff this year and I even got a new backpack so I want to just jump right on into this video. So the first thing in this video is obviously going to be the backpack. I got a new one this year like I said. The one that I showed in last year's video was super cute. But after using it for a full year, I realized that it wasn't all that user friendly. The main compartment wasn't big enough, I felt like, to hold all of my stuff. So I decided to get a new one this year. I am obsessed with this color. This color is everything. So this backpack is by Herschel. I will have it linked down below. It has a massive main compartment. So let's dive in. We're gonna do the main compartment first. You open it up and it has this like cute design. I just love this. One of the most important things that I bring in my backpack is a pair of glasses and an extra contact case because you guys all know, if you've been watching me for a while, I complain about my contacts all the time. I always have to carry a pair of glasses and my contact case in case I need to take my contacts out and put my glasses on because that happens all the time. These ones are from iBuyDirect and they are actually sponsoring today's video. So thank you to iBuyDirect for sponsoring today's video. If you guys don't know what iBuyDirect is, it's basically a website where you can order prescription glasses, sunglasses, glasses with blue light protection for those of us who stare at computer screens all day and even fashion glasses that don't have any prescriptions you just like you know the look of wearing glasses as an accessory there's over a thousand frames you can choose from and they are so much more affordable than ones at the eye doctor you guys know if you guys are out there right now and you wear glasses you know how expensive it is to buy glasses at the eye doctor that is why i have had the same frames for i don't even know how long because i cannot bring myself to buy $300 eyeglasses. I just can't do it. But they control the entire process of making the glasses. They basically just do all of it themselves and that is why it is so much more affordable. They also offer a feature where you can try the glasses for 14 days before actually committing to buying them to make sure that you like them, which is actually really helpful, especially for an online business because it's hard sometimes to know if things are gonna fit you the right way. They show you how to measure your face. They show you how to read your prescription so you can put it in when you're ordering. It really is so simple and there's such a great selection and it's so much more affordable. I'm really excited to give you guys this code if you guys are out there you wear glasses I have a 20% off code. You can use it on iBuyDirect. It's gonna be down in the description. It's Hannah20. You can get 20% off of your order from them. So if you guys need some new glasses for the upcoming school year, I have four pairs of glasses from them that they sent me and all of these glasses will be linked down below if you guys like them as well and you wanna check them out. So I have the Hepburn glasses, the Aura glasses, the Theory glasses, and the Resonance glasses. Thank you to iBuyDirect for sponsoring today's video. All the information is gonna be down below if you guys wanna check them out. Moving right along. So this year, my schedule is kind of wonky. If you guys are new to my channel, I transfer colleges. I'm a junior and I'm starting at a new school. So the way that they do their schedules at this new school is different from the way that my old school did it. It's a little weird, but I actually ended up getting three notebooks. I have two online classes. I have never had online classes before, but I picked up these two notebooks from Target. Are these not the most beautiful notebooks you've ever seen? I'm actually gonna keep these at my house because they are for online classes, but I wanted to show them in this video because they are part of my school supplies haul and they're so pretty my main notebook is like always a five star five subject college ruled notebook i like to have one notebook for all of my classes i guess technically now this is like for all the classes i actually have to go to the school for since i do have online classes this is my notebook for this first semester i really love this i've just found that using five subject notebooks and just keeping all of your stuff in one place it's a lot less wasteful at least for me because i know i don't use if i buy like five one subject notebooks I won't use all the pages and then I'm like what do I do with these notebooks this keeps everything in one place and it's convenient and it works for me I also bought a folder like I always do because even though the five subject notebooks have little like folder dividers in them sometimes I get so much paper for a class that it just overflows I can't put it all in there so this is kind of like an overflow folder I had to use this every semester that I've bought one Woo! this is the most fun part this is the best part of this entire haul buying an agenda a new agenda for the new school year is one of the most spiritual virtual experiences. It just feels so good. It makes me feel so organized, so ready, so prepared to take on all of the freaking ruling assignments that I'm about to have. So 
Here she is. This is my agenda for this year. She is from TJ Maxx. It is the same type of agenda that I had last year. The same brand, the same format. It is by the brand Fringe. At the beginning of each month, it has a cute little quote, which I think is adorable. And then it has this like at a glance page where you can write down stuff for the month. I think that's nice. Then there's like the whole monthly calendar and then it goes into each week. The way that this is laid out is so nice. I saw some other ones that I liked at TJ Maxx, but they weren't laid out the same way. I'm very specific and I feel like the way that my agenda is laid out is integral to me staying organized. So next in this big pocket. I have my calculator. This is the TI30XIIS. I've had this since high school and I have gone through two years of college. I've taken stat, I've taken calc and made it through it with this $10 calculator. So there are two main reasons why I bought this next item. One, because it was only a dollar. Two, because it's so freaking cute. But this is a set of index cards. What I love about this, like I said, it was a dollar. How do you say no? This is from Target, by the way. It has llamas on it. It literally is just a little book of these three by five index cards and I think this is so convenient because they're all in one place so you're not gonna lose them and they're not gonna get everywhere then when I bought this backpack from Herschel they were running this deal I don't know if they still have this but basically they gave me this free binder ring pencil case I guess you can put this in a binder if you have one but I personally don't I still really do like this little case it's really cute it's compact it's small and I just have my writing utensils in here. This backpack doesn't have a specific compartment or like slot for writing utensils. So I really like this. I can just pull this whole thing out and get what I need. These are the Bic Sparkle mechanical pencils. I get those every year. I got them last year as well. And I just like the way that they write. And then these are the Papermate Inkjoy gel pens. I got these last year as well. There's a bunch of different colors, but I just picked a few to keep in this. And then I have a few over there on my desk. And then obviously I have a highlighter in here because you never know when you're gonna need that. And then, I bought a pack of two thick Sharpie markers and a pack of two thin ones and I just want to keep one thin and one thick in here. I feel like I always need one of these. Like for random reasons, I'll be like, I'll have to ask other people to, if they have Sharpies because I never have my own. So I finally got my own. So then the last thing in this big compartment is my little laptop section here in the back. I also have my charger in this section. This is my phone charger. I lost the box to this. That's why it looks like this. Honestly, one of my family members probably took it and I mean, it works the same, so it's fine. And then... I have my laptop. This is the MacBook Pro 2017 13 inch. Yeah, I've had this for two years. I have the same case, same everything as last year. The only thing that's changed is that I've added more stickers to it as I've collected them. But this marble laptop case is from Amazon. I'll have this link down below as well. I got tons of questions on last year's video asking me where this case was from. Link is down below. Thank me later. Okay, so then we have this pocket in the front and I am keeping everything that's really not school supplies in here. So you'll see what I mean by that. There's a ton of stuff in here. I feel like most of the stuff that I keep in my backpack in college isn't even school supplies related. It's just like life related because you never know when you're gonna need any of this. Shit. First things first, for all the headaches that college gives me, I kept some of this stuff in the packages just for the sake of like the haul part of this video. I bought this from the travel section in Target. I love that section because it's just a bunch of mini products. I always need to carry Tylenol or ibuprofen with me because I'm always getting headaches from school, literally. Next thing, this is such a necessity. This is my favorite gum of all time, the Orbit Bubble Mint. I also like to keep a lotion, like a hand cream in my backpack because if my hands are dry, it like irritates me. And school is irritating enough, so like I don't need my hands to be adding to that. So this is just a little hand cream from Bath & Body Works. This has proven to be one of the most useful things. This is actually my second one because I went through the whole first one. A bitch is really messy. You need a tie to go stick. You just need one. You never freaking know. Always a really good thing to keep with you. Next are my AirPods. This is... Who goes to college without headphones? I just couldn't imagine. Next. I hate dry skin and I hate dry lips. I can't even tell you how many backpack chapsticks I went through last year. Like I'm always applying chapstick. Always, always, always. Hand sanitizer. They didn't have any of the cute pump ones that I got last year from Target, which is really upsetting because I love that, but... I need hand sanitizer, so that's that. I always keep a pack of tissues with me for obvious reasons. You know, you gotta blow your nose. What are you gonna do if you don't have tissues? Absolutely correct, nothing. And then this is the last thing in this little compartment. It's just this little card wallet type of deal. I just bought it from Target the other day. It just looks like this, it has a few slots. And since I am going to a new school, I'm getting a new ID. And I'm just gonna keep it in this, in my backpack, instead of having the card holder on the back of my phone. So I just bought this little thing for like $7 and I'm gonna put that card in here, maybe some cash or whatever, I don't know, so that I can easily 
literally grab it and whatever if I need it. The last thing I really love about this backpack, this is the classic extra large. I think that's what it's called from Herschel. Like I said, I'll have it in the description, but the reason I got the extra large one, A, because I really like having all this space, B, because this one had pockets on the side and the just regular classic one didn't and I have to have pockets on the side. I really like that it is two because I like to keep an umbrella in one and water bottle in the other. I haven't chosen my water bottle for this year yet. I don't know if I'm going to buy a new one because when I was coming home from LA, I was a dumbass and I forgot to drink. Like I forgot the whole like you can't bring a full water bottle through security and I didn't drink enough of my water for it to pass so the TSA agent threw my water bottle away so I need a new one I haven't found one yet that's why I don't have that in this haul sorry for the inconvenience but that seems to be the end of my haul god I can't stop looking at this backpack can we talk about the color I could really cry okay anyway so that is the end of today's video hope you guys enjoyed this i know this is like kind of early for back to school and it's making me sad but the early bird gets the worm am i right thank you guys for watching this video hope you guys liked it if you did make sure to give it a thumbs up if you want to see more videos from me make sure you subscribe if you have not already comment down below what year of school you're gonna be in and also comment down below if you've gotten to this point in the video i'm a real one because you're a real one i hope you guys all have a wonderful rest of your day and i'll see you guys in my next video bye mm -hmm.